and welcome back to Love Your Food. This week we have a quick and simple recipe for you. This salad uses the uh, the cinnamon candy canned pears we did a few weeks ago, and it makes a really fantastic little simple salad. Uh, if you don't have the cinnamon candy canned pears, you can also use regular canned pears for this, or even fresh pears. So here's our ingredients. We've got this uh, really nice sort of spring mix greens. We've also got some fresh uh, watercress. We're going to be using some lemon juice and some oil, whatever salad oil you prefer, some feta cheese, some pecan halves, and those great uh, cinnamon candy canned pears we made a little while ago. So these are we made those with uh, hot tamales. You can also make them with red hots. So we're going to start by toasting our pecans. So these are going to go into uh, the, our toaster oven. And then uh, we're going to go on to make the dressing for our salad. So a little bit of lemon juice, a little bit of oil. You can use olive oil or uh, we used just a very nice um, uh, plain canola oil for this. Whatever you prefer. Uh, a neutral oil is fine. Now we're using sort of a spring mix, which is not a particularly bitter green mix. So it doesn't need a whole lot of, um, for instance, salt or other flavors. Uh, a very light dressing is just fine for something like this. There's going to be a lot of other flavors included uh, with the feta cheese and the pecans and, of course, the pears. So next we're going to get everything else ready to uh, put in our salad. So we're just going to cut these pears up. Now we cut these into quarters when we first made these uh, these canned pears. So we're just going to cut these into just smaller little bite-sized pieces that we're going to distribute through our salad. Really it's up to you how big you want them. We're just going to cut them in half and then into uh, eight from there. And then uh, for the feta cheese we're actually going to cut this really really small into very small little cubes, a very fine dice. It helps to have uh, a very sharp knife for this. And there you go. That's about uh, that's about the size we want for that. And then when everything's ready, so when your uh, pecans have come out of the oven and uh, they've cooled for a little while, they've gotten crispy, then we're going to do our dressing. So we're going to add our spring mix and the cress to um, the bowl with the dressing in it. The whisk helped uh, just emulsify everything together. A little dash of salt in there. And you just want to give this a light toss until everything is well coated. A little bit of uh, fresh cracked black pepper as well. Now we may have overdressed this a little bit. We may have added a little bit too much of the salad dressing for the amount of greens we had. But again, that's entirely up to you. If you like a very, uh, very dressed salad, then this might be perfect for you. And once everything's nicely coated, once you've got all the dressing on there, it's ready to go. So we're just going to pop that on the plate. And we're going to top that with our uh, with our pears once we've got enough uh, per person. We just want to make sure everyone gets a fair amount here. Our spring mix comes from uh, a local producer who sent it to us in soil. So these are extremely fresh. They came to us live. <laughs> We're just going to top that off with a little bit of the feta cheese and the nice crispy, uh, they seem pretty dark, but they are beautifully toasted pecans. I want to make sure they get a nice good toasty flavor on there. And that's it. That's the whole thing. Really, really simple. Uh, the flavors come together really, really well. That hot uh, cinnamon candy in the pears adds this beautiful little accent. The... Uh, the rest of the flavors, you have this great textural balance as well, the crispiness of the pecans and the pears and the feta cheese and that nice fresh greens. It's amazing. So if you like this recipe, please do like and subscribe. And if you have any recipes you'd like to see Chef Caleb try on the channel, please let us know in the comments below. And remember to love your food. Mm -hmm.